level. God damn, Jonathan, you're going off your head. What's going, guys? My name's Jonathan, and welcome back to some more Modern Warfare 2. <laughs> Hold on, after looking at the video, what on earth was that noise? <laughs> For today's video, I'm actually going to be trying to use the ISO 45. The only problem is I don't have it unlocked, so give me a minute. Four hours later. We finally unlocked it after four hours. I swear, the lobbies were the sweatiest lobbies of my life. There was such a pain in the ass. Yep, you get people to see the elf skins using the bloody Tuck V. Or the Vars next, like, come on, get a life. Then you had that one lobby of people saying I'm hacking, and it's like, how the hell am I hacking? Well, at least we unlocked it. Well, it's ten past seven, and I am going to bed. The next day. Very dangerous to go to bed after after work. Okay, let's get into it. Well, damn, it's not too long now until we get the X Defiant beta coming out. Do you find it crazy, though, how we gained the beta legit, like, in, I don't know, a couple of days? Hopefully, it's actually okay, because, mate, if the beta does not turn out to be good, I am going to lose it. Uh oh, well, what can you really do, eh? Vezzy bongs. What's with Xbox players with bongs? <laughs> well, it's 4.17pm, and I'm finally using the... Wait, why is this called again? ISO 45. I got this camo on it as well. I mean, it looks okay. <laughs> Damn! Was there a weapon back in Modern Warfare 2019 that was the exact same as this? I swear there was a weapon. I don't know what it was. Jesus Christ, Damien, you want to try any harder? Still gets me, though, how Ubisoft and, like, Mark Rubin is, like, talking about with the whole X Defiant. Like, to me, it's insane of how much communication that he's doing. Like, I've never seen a developer with that much communication on a multiplayer game. I know I say this all the time, but thank you all for the love and support on my previous video. Like, man, that video did so well. Also, including that we've got 225 subscribers now. Like, we gained roughly over 100 subscribers in a month. Do you know how insane that is for me? Like, I wasn't expecting to have that many subscribers in like a month and all these people commenting of how on earth do you only have these many subscribers and talking about with my air ting and how the video is actually entertaining it was like for me i'm quite shocked about how much support i am really getting on these videos like my x defiant video has got over six thousand views i think like it's crazy to me of how it's just like on how it took me a long time to get back onto youtube and all of a sudden it's actually working out really well for me Ooh. But for the final time, I really appreciate every single one of you that have commented, liked, and even subscribed. I really appreciate it. What's with everyone using the Vars neck today? What on earth is going on? I also saw that the Razorback is very, very overpowered. But the ISO feels quite nice as well. Like a fast-paced SMG. I like it. It just seems now that all these new weapons just feel much more faster. They feel like they've got quick draw and stock on. Why is it every time that I want to play this game, it never bloody works out because I'm just versing people with the fucking Vars necks? Like, I am quite close to unlock the Razor back, but yeah, it's going to take a while. Like, I started playing on the Saturday and trying to grind my ass off on the Sunday. And I finally unlocked the ISO, well, after playing the game for like eight hours. What on earth are these names? It made me laugh how the other day someone thought I was like cheating. I think I got the screenshot of it. And I took the piss out of it saying subscribe to my channel. And I accidentally spelt subscribe wrong and I was like, oop. <laughs> and the guy's like, I'm going to report your channel. I'm like, well, I'm still waiting. It's like, imagine he went onto my video and he's like, oh my god, you actually are hacking. Get a life, nerd. And it's like, hi, how you going? I don't know what enough that guy was trying to achieve, but yeah. That'd be a CDL skin, my ass. If I see you using a CDL skin with any of the tryhard weapons for ranked, you won't get bullied for the rest of your life. Just kidding, I'm not that type of person. Still gets me worried about the whole season war. It's like, I know season reloaded will be coming soon, but half the time it's like, pretty bare bones. Damn, man. Gun feels nice. Anyway, talking about the whole season reloaded, it's like I'm a little bit concerned about it. To me, it's like when they released a new season, like 4.5, there's like barely no content put in. What am I going to do? Like, am I going to take another like six months off? That's what it feels like. Like you played the game, then you take a bloody break off it. It's like, I wish we can just keep playing all the time. Just keep going, keep playing, have fun. But it's actually getting quite hard to do that time to time. But yeah, it still gets me about with the whole Call of Duty side of how like Activision is just boycotting all the old Call of Duty games. It gets to me time to time because it's like Activision is trying to boycott the old Call of Duty games so badly that they are forcing you to spend money and buy the newer Call of Duty games. That's also annoying as well of how they're charging full price for these old games. And it's like, I don't know, $100? And it's like, why would you buy something for that much when you know the game is not playable? You just can't go back to an old Call of Duty game and expect it to be, well, safe to play. It just does not work like that. You just can't do it. It's impossible to do. Oh God, sparkling water. Like for me talking about this, how like Activision hates 
hates Kawuji. It reminds me of the video I just watched about the Act Man. Like, he's talking about with the whole Kawuji side, how it's like, it shouldn't be allowed that they can make the old Kawuji games full price and it's hacked to shit. Like, they shouldn't be allowed to do that. Yeah, it's their game, but still, like, come on. You're trying to tell me that the old Kawuji game is the same price as a new Kawuji? Explain that to me. Uh, hey, whatever's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and night so far. Be mentally positive like always, because like what I always say, there's always the positive side of life. I think this is going to take a while for me to get used to this gun then. Oh, you know it was some bull crap the other day? Well, not that. Was that, you know how people were talking about with the whole skill-based damage of how, like, if you're a better player, you get, like, killed faster and your bullets don't have as much damage as, a, like, a worse player? Like, legit, that happened to me a couple of days ago and I was starting to lose it. Like, I was getting killed within, like, two bullets all because I had that one good game when I got that 51 kills on my last video. And it's like, a lot of people are saying, oh, it doesn't exist. And it's like, don't tell me that this stuff doesn't exist. It does. Skill-based matchmaking exists. Skill-based damage exists. They force you to spend money it's like they force you to spend money so you can play with easier players. Like, why can't we just go back to the old days of Call of Duty and just play for fun? You guys remember back in the day when you used to just play Call of Duty and you used to always have different lobbies? Like you had the easy lobbies and you had the sweat lobbies. Now it's like you have one good lobby and the rest of the lobbies are the most sweatiest lobby of your life. And it's not fun. You tell them, mate. You tell them. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Hang around the rosy. Oh! Hey, what do you guys think? Do you believe in that sort of stuff? Because when I keep playing the game, it's like, oh, fuck me. I'm starting to lose it. If you guys wondering about the answer about the ISO 45, it's okay. It's as good as, like, the mini back and the bloody... <laughs> And the hurricane? No. Nope. You know what's one thing I also realized that I didn't do the other day? I didn't download my graphics card properly. I was wondering why my, like, monitors and all of that looked so bloody bad. And when I was looking through the, like, LG's website, they said about the whole graphics card to properly install. And I was like, oh. So I went and downloaded the whole graphics card and all of that. Walk off of this sport and die, sport and die shit, eh? That's Modern Warfare 2 for you. Yeah, literally. It gives me the biggest mind grind, bro. Yeah, it's like, if any war, I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Especially the season 4 update, it's what actually, uh, I think the... Season 4 update was made to get to me, man. Like, it was mainly just for Warzone. It's like, ever since Warzone came out, multiplayer has gone worse and worse, like, every year. It's like they care more about the whole Warzone bullshit than the, than the multiplayer. Yeah, to be honest, yeah. Nut bundles are more important to them. Make a billion dollars in, like, I don't know, like, like 10 days. <laughs> You guys wonder why multiplayer is not going to be fixed. Activision, everyone. Well, sorry about that. Anyway, when I was talking about the whole graphics card, I was just sitting here like, am I stupid? Yes! Yes! Then I went onto the settings and I looked properly and I was like, oh, there we go. And now I can properly look at my content much more better than what it is. <laughs> Okay, so I need six more kills with the ISO, 40 kills with the ADS, 30 blank kills, 20 kills from behind. Don't get any ideas from that. That's a nice looking camo. Then I can start working on the gold, platinum, polyatomic, and the Orion. This is going to take a while for me to unlock. Oh yeah, I think I'm going to try and get those four camos. Then I think I'm just going to take it easy with the gold. Then start working on the rest of the camos on my next video, I believe. But hey, if you haven't subscribed already, hey, I can't say why not. Because now we're on the road to 300 subscribers. Jim's butt stuff. What on earth did I just read? Okay. Okay, yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, no wonder why. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. thanks, Call of Duty. Thanks. Why the fuck would you even bother to put me in a lobby like this? Oh, wait. Call of Duty? <laughs> I mean, it's not as bad as that Jim's butt stuff. Jim's wife! She goes all right! I just killed Joel. You get it, Joel? You get it? Just kidding. Love you. No homo. Wow. Sick. Chopper gunner. Veto. Wow. Amazing. Thank you, Cool G, for putting me in the lobby. I absolutely love it. Thank you so much. Is there any point of even playing any more? Huh? I'm just going to sit back and relax. Yep. His balls easy mac and major muck up 1v1. Yep. There's no point of playing the game. I'm going to lose anyway. So I'm going to sit here and just, um, yeah. Wow. Well, it's so much more entertaining. Come on, guys. You only need four more kills. You can do all this. See that guy right there? Is he, is he blind? Oh, there's one there. Yeah. Sensation. Amazing. Absolutely love it. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That one. I joined light and I did fuck all. Let's go. That's the way, brother. What was I supposed to do? You got a kill. You did better than some of the company. Yeah, look. Yeah. yeah, one kill. Except that guy. He got zero. So you got to be positive in your life. What guy was going to say? I went one and eight. Well, yeah, I, I did join late. I wasn't really able to really do much. So what do you really expect me to really do? How was I supposed to get kills when you had fucking VTOLs and fucking jumper gunners in the game? Like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Well, the good thing about it was I was listening to California Love while drinking my sparkling Waterford's water. I know, that was very specific. Oh, my God!
<laughs> Sometimes it still gets me. Why is there no logical sense in this game? Like, it makes no logical sense to take away map voting. Like, why on earth are they gatekeeping the players of what maps they want to play? It still gets me down how it's like, why on earth are we playing Black Gold, Hactory, Lighthouse, and Border Crossing? I swear, I find more lobbies of those maps than the actual good maps in this game, which is very rare. It's like, I spend 99% of the time leaving before even playing the actual game. It's like, it gets me time and time on like, does Infinity Ward even play their own bloody map? I feel like they just get recruit bots on it and call it a day. I don't know how that- This is what players are. Jesus Christ, man. You want to try any harder? It's on a fucking casual. Oh, it's only a Monday and why are you starting to lose it? Yeah, I don't know if Finny was ever going to recover from this, man. And my keyboard just turned off. Is there a ghost in here? I wonder half the time, all because I have one good game, I get put into a lobby like this. I can imagine you found like a lobby that was just with the biggest noobs of all time you were able to stay in it, like, oh, mate, that would be heaven. I remember back on, like, Black Ops 4 days, and even BO3 days, of when you found that one god-tier lobby, you stayed in it, you never left. It was so much fun. But yeah, I'm gonna keep talking about skill-based matchmaking until the day I die. Unless X Defiant comes around and does a complete 180, I'll just be like, yep, see you later, cool, Judy, have a good one, I'm gonna go home, go to bed. Me laughed, though, how the other day when Damien was talking to me about how it's like, I play Call of Duty, but I talk so much shit about it. It's like, you're just gonna talk about it just to get your mental, like, strength back up again. What do you guys think about with the whole Modern Warfare 2, like with the multiplayer? Do you guys think they're going to change it anytime soon, or is this what it's going to be like for the rest of the life cycle? It still gets me how we're getting a new Call of Duty game in like, I don't know, like four months, four or five months, I think. Because I swear, if they add in all of the good maps at the end of the life cycle, I am going to lose it. But to be honest, I really hope that the next Call of Duty game gets just boycotted or disliked bomb to crap. Like, I really hope that this happens to them. I do feel for the developers that make these games because they put their heart and soul into it. Because of the management side, they get screwed over. And that was very good lag. Oh, oh my god, thank you. Why is every time I say the gun's like okay and it all of a sudden it's like good? Why does that always happen to me every time I say this? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Zingerbox. I'm, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. <laughs> he left. He left. Yeah, it still gets me that some people haven't unlocked Goldie on a single gun. Zingerbox. That reminds me of one thing. Fuck, that's Zigzag. That's a stinky one. Fuck, that smells like a Zigzag, bro. You're welcome. Okay, what on earth did I just do? Bunch of cake, mud, shut up, mate. Okay, I forgot I unlocked attachments. Give me a minute. Yeah, it still gets me on how much crap there's in the battle pass. Like, the stores have better content, man. If you haven't known already, yes, Alex is back. We still need to do the raid mission, Joel. Like, why can't we have something like this in the battle pass? Go and play ranked play, you fuck. Oh my god. Why is every time I have one good game, I get put into lobbies like that? Yeah, fucking CDL ski with vast neck. I'm not so good, I'm okay. good. Like, for God's sake. I'm not border crossing. I don't know what it is with Core G today, but God's a pain in the ass. Oh yeah, thanks team. <laughs> okay. Okay then, we at least we got that camera unlocked. I turned around for two seconds, I died! I don't know how that worked, but I'm, uh, yeah. Bingo! Well, at least I unlocked the ADS camo. Yeah, I'm gonna start working on this when I stop recording. That's gonna be the video for today, guys. If you haven't liked and subscribed already, please do so, because we're on the road to roughly 300 subscribers at the moment. And if you guys haven't liked the video already, please do so, because the more you do that, the more the video will get recognized and get pushed out onto recommended pages. But don't worry, my next video will be me unlocking the gold camo for the ice side, and I'll be working on the Razorback afterwards. Anyway, guys, my name's Jonathan. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day and night And like always, be mentally positive There's always the positive side of life Not besides all of that, I'll see you guys later Yep, CDL skins are gonna kick my ass